Code Red! Code! New My Hero trailer. There's a new character trailer. There's a lot of gameplay here. I'm very curious to see the new Deku in action. I'm very curious to see the old characters and how much has changed. This is gonna be my reaction. This looks... okay, yeah. Same shit style Deku. We're gonna have a breakdown. Oh, there's a, a little new animation there. Okay. Mirio! We saw a lot of gameplay from this guy already. I doubt there's anything to surprise us here, though. That move looks cool. I was proven wrong immediately. <laughs> this is level 2 plus ultra. Power! Yeah! Oh, bring me some Tamaki. Uh. He's got he's got this pull move that seems perfect for resets. Uh we're gonna break it down later. Okay. Okay. That's an okay animation. I give it um seven out of ten. I still don't know her quirk. I, I, people said she explained it in the anime. I still don't understand it. I, I don't know. It's a, she shoots waves? What's that? What waves? Waves of what? Not not the biggest fan. <laughs> Ashido! Oh, she's gonna be Zoni Master. Did you see that setup? Did she just put up a wall of acid? I didn't know she break danced. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's new for me. Mineta! What is that yellow attack? What the hell was that? He just jumped away and came back, dude. The world demands it, indeed. Full cowling! 100%! That yellow seems like a nightmare. That is a projectile? Day one broken. I'm calling it right now. Day one broken. What was that? Not okay. Not not okay. Okay, uh, breakdown time, I guess. Let's let's do this. From shoot style Deku, all the moves seem the same. Even the plus ultra seems the same, but there's an extra little animation. I think I haven't seen this his, le his level two in a while, so maybe there isn't. But I think there is. Mirio, brand new character. We saw a lot of gameplay in the past. Click, uh, click here if you want to watch that. I pointed to the wrong side, didn't I? I do like this uh, three strike permeation thing. One, two, three. That seems like one of his quirk buttons for sure. All right, Amajiki, brand new. We haven't seen a lot of gameplay from this guy. That pool is insane. Now, here's the thing. Whether that pull is good or not depends on the following hit. Because he pulls and then he hits you with a shell, right? If that's all part of the same move and cannot be cancelled, this move is just okay. If you can pull and cancel the hit, that is so good for resets. Look at him, he's floating off the ground. That is prime reset material right there. So it all depends on that shell. If you can cancel that shell from hitting, that is a very good move right there. The Swordfish, he uses it at close range, but it seems to be a ranged option. Because it does have a lot of range right there. And then the wings, I'm not sure what the wings are all about. Every character can jump in the air, every character can do aerial combos. So for him to have the wings, maybe he has a float uh, ability, kind of like Inasa currently has. It really isn't clear from the trailer alone. We're gonna have to wait and see more. Now Nejire, my confusion about her quirk aside, she seems to be a zoning character, but not the type of zoner that can reach you full screen. Her zoning seems quite limited, so she's gonna be one of those mid-range characters. At least that's the first impression I'm getting. Because if you look at her waves outside of this one that's really big, every wave she does uh, has sort of a limited reach. Not quite as small as Bakugo's small explosions, but kind of in that vein. Her plus ultra is a... Uh, whatever. Now, Mina Ashido was probably the most interesting out of all of them. And it, it starts right at the beginning. She brings you back down to the ground with this move right here. Perfect for assist extensions. Perfect, perfect, perfect. She brings you back down to the ground with that move. That means it's an easy extension, easy to pick up and just start the combo all over again. With something like the current Bakugo, which by the way, I hope Bakugo's assist gets nerfed. But if it doesn't, the current Bakugo is going to extend this combo, leaving the opponent in the air. Easy reset, easy extension, easy whatever you want to do. She can shoot acid as sort of a projectile. And this wall right here, it, it's only a couple of frames. But you can see that there are acid puddles behind Jiro and then she puts this acid wall in front. I don't know if that becomes a puddle too or if that's an actual wall. But either way, Mina seems crazy strong based on these little clips alone. 
And she's gonna be the new setup queen, isn't she? You won't dethrone my Dobby, but I'm loving the setups. Also, break breakdance. Huh? Okay, Mineta overall doesn't seem that special until he did this yellow attack, which is just what? That's gonna counter any yellow attack. But yeah, he throws a lot of uh, balls and uh, you can see that his combos also leave some balls attached to the, to the opponent. There's definitely a gimmick with the balls here. Not really sure what they do. Maybe they slow down your movement speed. That's maybe the most obvious thing they may, might do. And then he hits uh, to you with his butt on his plus ultra. Because it's Mineta. Alright, let's get to the problem of this video. F full Cal 100%. Uh, his moveset seems kind of similar to Shoot Styles, which, you know, makes sense. It's the same character. Cut him some slack. This yellow, fuck this. Fuck this yellow attack. I've seen this way too many times on Shoot Style Deku. This one's even faster. No. No. That's a problem. You better give that thing a ton of recovery and not allow him to cancel into shit. That's... No, his flip kick is now a projectile. It releases a, a wave of wind as if that wasn't a problem enough Now it's just stronger. My first impression of full Cal is that they took a top tier character shoot style Deku and they just made him stronger What are you doing? I'm complaining a lot, but this is just hype <laughs> God, I'm so excited for this. Whoo. All right guys. Uh, as far as I know there are only three characters remaining to be announced So who do you want it to be? Let me know your picks Who's the character you really want to be announced next in the comments down below and as always thank you very much for watching My name is Globku, and I'll see you next time. Bye